Let P be a two digit number and Q be the number consisting of the same digits written in reverse order. So let P be AB and Q be BA. If P into Q is equal to 2430, what is the difference between P and Q? Notice that the last digit of the given number is 0. We know that the product of any number ending with 0 will give the answer also ending with 0. So let's take 10. But if you reverse these digits, it's going to give you 1, which is not a two digit number. Hence, we can conclude that P or Q is not going to end with a zero now let's look at some other options which will give a product of zero at the end for example five twos are ten so let's check with five and two so the numbers will be 25 and 52 multiplying these will give us a zero at the end so what are the other possibilities that will also satisfy this condition any even number multiplied with five is going to give zero at the end we have four fives are 20 six fives are 30 and eight fives are 40 so these are the only two digits with which you can get zero at the end. With this, we can easily form the values that P and Q can take because they are just going to interchange their numbers between them. So they'll be 45 and 54, 65 and 56, 85 and 58. Now let's solve for 25 and 52. The product of 25 and 52 is 1300. Let's go for 45 and 54. The product of 45 and 54 will give us 2430. Thus, we have found out the values of P and Q. Now, the question is to find the difference between P and Q. Let's take the larger value first. So, 54 minus 45 will give us 9. So, option D is the right answer.